This is the new electric one-man rigging system from IMI Gliding. I will show you how to assemble it. It's quite simple. So we remove the body. This is the remote. We put in the battery, which is quite simple. Just put it in this bracket. Connect the connector. Side. So good. Now we put the main axle in. What means we remove the pins, put the axle in like this, put the wheels on. Also, the actuator bracket. So we have the manual movement here. Maybe like this. Pull the pin out. Connect. Ready to use. We put the remote control on. Check the battery. It shows 100%, so we can we can start to operate the rigging. Connect the ring holder to the body, which is quite simple job. Let me show you. We will use the fourth position, the third third position for our. Piece. Drive to the fuselage. to assemble the glider. into the middle or more to the front position, to the leading edge position. So, I will take the root and the trailing edge and simply rotate the wing like this. It has an end stop which 
which is adjustable, so it's quite safe again. And then I will show you that still it's moving quite smoothly up and down. And still under the full load, it's about 10 millimeters per second, so it's, it's not a waste of time, it's just a useful helper. So this is the first test of the electric one-man rigging system with Arcus in the hangar. So let's put the device on, check the battery, let's see it's full and we will show how the linear actuators how strong they are. So this is up. The full load of the wing of the Arcus traveling with some 10 millimeters per second. And the travel is 260 millimeters in total. No problem. So, up. You can see the height, it's just perfect. So, you can see it's the root of the wing is approximately in the height for, for inserting in the, into the fuselage. And we have the wing at the end of the inner panel is about 160 centimeters high. So quite a lot. So now to show how it travels down. Of course a bit quicker. and moving it to the sides. So, to the end stop. And again, it's the same actuator, 260 millimeters travel and 1500 newtons strength. We have nice brakes prepared for this device. They are not yet ready, but they will be installed during the next week. So that's it.